on the Pacific Islander, my first overnighter, and overnight on the Pacific Islander. Let's see what you got. You got two. Hey. <laughs> Hold them up. Get in there, son. <laughs> That's my boy. Two at a time. Let me see. <laughs> He's got two. All right, go ahead, let go. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> Look at the camera ham. Oh, he gets it. Good job. Asshole. Okay, put the rod down and then wind them like that. There you go. All right, lift with me. All right, I got it. I fish with... <laughs> Hold on. Cod have to be 22 inches to keep. They're not the prettiest fish, more prehistoric looking than anything. But you see that big mouth there. They uh, they eat mostly other fish, so their meat's a little different, a little bit more firm, more like a chicken breast. And also with their diet, eating like octopus and stuff makes their their meat change colors. Like this one here is green. You even get them blue, aqua. Don't worry, as soon as you put them uh, in the in the in the pan, they turn white. Really good eating fish. But again, you come home with the bag of fillets and you got some blue ones in there, scare the missus a little bit. So with them, these big mouths and the big fish that they eat allows you to use bigger baits. Like here, we got a big poncho's plastic, the Ahi Assault Diamond Jig, some two odd hooks with an anchovy work good today too. I got a couple on that, but anywhere from eight to uh, 16 ounces of lead. So the fishing's been pretty good. We got some red snapper here, some vermilion. Some nice ling cod here. Again, they have to be 22 inches to keep. Kind of a game fish for, for rock fishing. They put up a pretty good fight. The limit on them is two, and they gotta be 22 inches to keep. So come out here and catch yourself a nice limit of ling cod. Some red snapper on the Pacific Islander at a Channel Island Sport Fishing, the Real Anglers Fishing Show. Let's go. Got a right nice here. ling on the big poncho bait. Oh, yeah. On the plastic. <laughs> 